Welcome to my channel. I'm Zhang Jingxu. Let's look at the problem forty-one in chapter twenty-two. Chapter twenty-two is about the Gaussian's law. So we can see there we have a flat ring. Inner radius r naught, outer radius four times r naught. The charge that carries Q. We need to determine the electric field dense at different locations. So in this one, the first part is the distance. From the center is 0.25 r naught, so it is around there, right? You can see, compared to r naught and four times r naught, this 0.25 r naught is very small. So we can consider this is just the model, the electric field dense of the infinite plant. Do you agree? Yes. And also, you look at the problem. Uh, it will give you the hint. The hint tells you the ring can be placed with two upside charged superposed disks. So this gives you answer, right? So we can consider this ring as two disks. One disk with the radius four times r naught carry charge capital Q plus negative or uh, plus the small little Q small Q. Another disk is the radius r naught. The charge carry is negative Q. Agree? So this ring can be replaced by these two. Now, can you find the electric field for this disk uh, at this location, 0.25 R0? Sure, because this part, we can consider this is a electric field just above an infinite plane, right? The similar for this one. So we can write the electric field for this uh, renders with uh, 4 times R0 as the capital Q plus little Q divided by epsilon naught. And uh, this, is, uh, this term comes from this part, the first disk. The second disk gives us the term negative Q divided by epsilon naught. So we get a final answer there. The second one tells you now we consider the distance is 7. 5 R0 from the center of the ring. So that means it is around zero, very far away, right? So this distance is really far away from the ring to the location. So in this case, we can consider this ring can be considered as a point charge. Do you agree? So because this is super far away, we don't care about its size, its shape. So in this one, we just use our favorite equation for point charge effect electric field is the charge divided by 4 pi epsilon naught and this one is a distance squared. Thank you.